You can associate a variable of the DME series energy meters with a relay exit, such as the threshold values, seen in the preceding video for example, either to communicate with a PLC and open or close a contactor, or to set off an alarm. Here's how. After installing this EXM1001 expansion with two digital inputs and two relay outputs, and after powering it correctly, you can check the association between the energy meter and expansion using the reports screen of the new configuration that appears when it is switched on. Save the configuration by pressing the confirm key. Enter the settings, then scroll down to the outputs menu, M14. Confirm. This DME D310T2 energy meter already has two integrated outputs, to which we will add the two in exchange of the EXM1001 expansion. Now select output 3, which is the one for the relay in this case, with the confirm key. The output function will be that of the limit set in the previous video. So select LIM on the menu. The channel will be 1. And after entering these settings, use the up and down arrows simultaneously to exit and reboot the device, saving the settings. Let's try to trip the limit and the output associated with it by letting it slide more than 70 amps. As you can see on the specific screen, the variable limit is enabled as soon as the delay time we set for it has passed.